Enjoy your trip to the big city. It's done then. The transmitter has been modified. I'm all set. But what about the reactor? The initial round of tests is finished. All readings are nominal. So yes, I think we're ready. I'll let you do the honors. This, my friends, is the moment we've all worked towards. After all your effort, the time has finally come to start our reactor. No longer will we be forced to compromise to survive. No more will we need worry about outpacing our resources. My father and I couldn't be more proud of what you have helped us accomplish. And we look forward to achieving even greater things in the future. The Institute is now truly mankind's best hope. Thank you. All of you. Son. It's almost hard to believe. After all those years of hard work, here we are. We've arrived. Look what you've made possible. Now that the reactor works, what's next for the Institute? We'll get to that. There's more work to be done before the Institute's future is guaranteed. The Directorate has convened a meeting about how to proceed. I'm not going to attend. You should be there as Director. Surplus power should translate to increased efficiency and productivity. Ah, there you are. You've met with the director. I assume they made their intentions known? It was difficult for them to reach the decision to engage in open hostility. What about you? Do you agree with their decision? How long has this been coming? When did they decide on this course of action? The arrival of the Brotherhood's airship was the final straw, really. There's just too much at stake. We... You can't afford to lose it all. You know, Father, it's no secret that you worked with the Railroad in order to first reach the Institute. The depth of your involvement with them has been called into question repeatedly. I'm sure you can guess by whom. The question is, where do you stand with them now? Do you count them amongst your allies? Does it matter? What are you getting at? I think it's obvious. For the Institute's position in the Commonwealth to be secure, the railroad must be eliminated. Completely. As our primary above-ground operative and someone who has had previous contact with the railroad, you are in the best position to carry this out. So what I'm getting at, simply, is... Are you willing to destroy them? I can take care of them. Good. Good. I don't enjoy asking you to put yourself in harm's way, but this is so important. Get out of here. We've heard some very disturbing things about you. That you've been to the Institute. That you're actually working with those monsters. You're lucky we don't shoot you on sight. Who told you that? I'm not about to divulge anything sensitive to you. Get the hell out of here, and don't come back.
get out of here.
maintenance requests should be directed to the facilities division. And so, the work is done. I am sorry. I know it was likely difficult for you. You're confident the railroad is finished? As confident as we can be. It was always a loose network. But with the key players gone, it's not impossible that they'll be back someday. But it will take them time. There is obviously one final threat the Institute faces. What is it? What's this last threat? Well, perhaps it's not that obvious after all. The Brotherhood of Steel covets technology and has made it clear that we cannot peacefully coexist. They will eventually come for us and attempt to take what we've spent so long creating. We need to destroy them before they can destroy us. Destroy them? What exactly do you mean? I mean we eliminate all Brotherhood forces in the Commonwealth. But the problem with the Brotherhood of Steel goes beyond the edges of the Commonwealth. It's not enough to destroy them here. There are more of them out there in the world, Father. And they too will come for us. You have something in mind if that happens. I'd like to prevent it from happening in the first place. We will show them that if they interfere with us, the very technology they value so highly will be turned against them. We will teach them that we can appear at a moment's notice, wherever we please, and they cannot ever stop us. They will know better than to ever interfere with us again. So we're just going to attack them? There's a plan that's a little more involved than that. Dr. Lee should be expecting you in her lab. She can fill you in on the details. Time is of the essence. <laughs>